Today's Healthy Living will be presented in EV with subtitles in Arabic, Aulaxis, Vietnamese, Chinese, English, EV, French, German, Indonesian, Japanese, Korean, Malay, Persian, Portuguese, Russian, Thai, and Spanish. Nkola nya nuwo, ni awe zonva akbe jaji nono, le nu fi ala gan ape nukpo molaji. Doto kwa si ofe yi agye man, to gana nyi gmanji, enye amesi le ekbe ape woname. Ape to dokto kwa si ofe yi agye man, enye jojo me doyo lade, si wadok ple la madu madu hapopwa le epe dukome. Eye wodo agbe ye ye doyo pe, si kpe nade dono onti, okwa doyo yo, to jaji nye nye, Ple ndudu si me la me le o. Alo ndudu si me o me da o. Alo ndudu si me o da le juko ho blane vo aden gome hafidui. Jojo me do yo tutu do le jojo me nu yanti. Be monu po kwa de le ame gbe to pe la me si. E ye wo kwa nou sende do le le ji, e da do le e do kwi si. Jojo me do yo gali kakple, a fò de de, si wo khe a mona do le le, gma le, gome je je me. Le jojo me do da da me la, ta do ji nou e nye be, wa akul bo ajra do nou ape la me sen, ple de de non non do, jojo me to e. Si ke di a, Do yo yo si a koude a mag be ti ke o nou Kame de de a ti toto ple ndoudou o nou ti Do to o fwi a gye ma kho khe khe Le english blo ti ne jo jo me nou nya Le gbe nou 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 sron pe a de me le nout London Ga ou a ou kho hen hen ne jo jo me do yo yo Le nou sron pe a de le jersey Ka ple nou sron pe si koude Ja ji nye nye nou ti le texas Amerika. Ape bubuto le la me sample ndudu gomea ope doto ofui agema de pepe vivyo abe la madu madu dolele ple enu chichi ta pepe le gana le pe ape ve fo ene me eye me didiwa e ponu le nye la madu la nana de hihi ape Ta pepe si me wope, a me toche. Bouboutou a nou fya la gan a shin hai, le lome. Togo, le reti a ton liya, pe nkeke a seke, le pe a peve. Vo a seke la ji. Fifia, mi a se cho, doktor o fuyi a gye mang bo. De ale si wo de vo vo toto, le ye vo ti ke wo, ple jo jo me dodo. Dada nou ti. We know that orthodox medicine has, uh, you know, dominated healthcare in this world since uh, 1909. Drugs do help in healing. Uh, we do not discount that. But drugs do not heal. It is only the human body that heals. It is true that uh, drugs can provide some relief. Uh, of course, if you are in pain, you need uh, Novocaine. If you have trauma, you need surgery. But to heal, conditions like cancer, hypertension, diabetes, and so on, you need to come to terms with the basic laws of sustaining human life. E si wo nye suku vila, doktor ofui agyema, dogo, jojo menu nyala, kwa siyade, cho Amerika. Ame siya wo elektrik kadi, mfo fo siya doli, epe no no me, ple do yo yo. Before I was 20, I was involved with uh, the Theosophical Science Society. Uh, I was uh, a vegetarian for 10 years. And then thereafter I went to Britain and uh, during the course of my studies, I came to terms with the quotation from uh, Thomas Edison, who said that the doctor of the future will give no medicine. 
He will influence his patients in the care of the human frame, in diet and in the prevention of disease. Thomas Edison influenced my thinking about the human body. Esime Dr. Ofui Agiema Uunu Sonsonula Englonu Epe Dono Be Wakpla Dede Nono Pe Afodede Abe Asi Dede Le Lanunti Le Open Dudu Omen. So uh, I would say that I rediscovered myself after you know I finished with my course and especially when I came into contact with the patients who I realized were very enthusiastic to apply the principles that I shared with them. And I realized that the more I submitted to the discipline that I was you know, prescribing for my patients, the more healthier I became. <laughs> It is obvious that uh, if we want to sustain life, it is only living elements that can provide life. And that word vegetarian comes from vegetus, we, uh, that means full of life. So essentially, anyone on this planet who wants to sustain his life, who wants to prevent disease, who wants to effect repair where it has occurred, must subscribe to vegetarianism. Le la madu madu, he na hi hi a pe de de. Tak pe pe jila, doctor of wii agema. Tutu blema hoseo chondu du me chatianti. Now, today, we have institutionalized the consumption of animal products in the name of a balanced diet. And so, whenever we are at table, we are supposed to eat animal products to sustain our protein intake. That is an untruth. There are proteins in all foods. There are proteins in all fruits. There are proteins in all vegetables. And besides, the most important thing is that we need to digest our food. Now, when you take animal products into your system, what happens is that the food is indigestible. Animal products are solid in our circulation, in our bloodstream. So that accounts for the um, incorrect circulation of which we have developed all the diseases that we are contracting today. Afisia, Dr. Ofui Agema, na podenu adeo, si de kadede, le tatia le ndudu si me, la me lewo, ple dole le titinu, I would say, first of all, malaria is endemic in Africa, and there are lots of uh, Ghanaians who, um, you know, sort of have experienced malaria almost two, three times every year. I would say the last time I experienced malaria was about 25 years ago, because my resistance is very high. Um, I know patients, you know, of mine who were diagnosed with HIV positive in 1983. They're still alive. Why is that so? The reason is that they have a very high resistance. So your diet is the single most important factor that if you change, can sustain your life and make it possible for you to prevent all diseases. My name Dr. Ofei. Agema aponu le afoku si o le landudu menti ta flache mi eno ni plemi le nu fi ala gan penu pomolaji La mesin, benonon, le nou fi alagan, pe nou pomoji. 
bien le nom complé ganavi jojo medoyola docteur ofei ageman amesi le zigede vai onu cho ndudu si melamano ula na epe dono o be esia nye monyu eto na ntila pe doyoyo dolele gbugbu adele agbanleji si la dudu nana si bona enye pode unde ka hypertension for instance uh, results from the cholesterol that we take from the animal products that we put into ourselves and you know the human body also produce cholesterol on a daily basis in fact we produce about four to five thousand milligrams of cholesterol every day is the cholesterol that is used for the manufacture of the hormones in our bodies so if we add any more cholesterol the animal products we have excess cholesterol that we cannot you know get rid of and and that begins to clog us up as it clogs our arteries you know and veins uh, circulation is compromised so essentially that is the source of uh, you know the hypertension the quality of your blood and it's the blood that sustains your body depends on the quality of the food that you put into yourself if you put uh, greasy food into yourself and greasy food come from animal products mainly uh, of course you cannot sustain your life you have a limitation with regard to your circulation bagba dolele le bobo e ne fu me sina nyu e le fu ka me in the past stroke used to be you know common in adults only these days even children as as young as 15 are developing stroke. In fact, in 1992, I had a case of someone who was only 12 having a stroke. You have a situation where we must systematically wean ourselves out of meat eating. Dr. Ofei Ageman, Blanc Afisi Abile Lame Jocho. We also have the uh, issue of uh, cancer. You know, cancer is an abnormal growth that results from the abnormal elements that we put into ourselves. Once you take meat, you are eating more protein than your body it can cope with. Now, protein cannot be stored in your body. The body can store sugars, it can store carbohydrates, it can never store protein. The more protein you have, the more you create problems for your system. But if we contract cancer and we revert to the process, the natural process of feeding the body, it will stimulate the body to effect the repair. The body is self-healing, self-repairing, self-restoring, as long as we provide the elements that are required. And those elements are the fruits and vegetables. Doyola Nuela, Blanc Epe Nuntepe Popo, be bien chi agbedono si de tacho la dudugo you know the cooking process compromises the elements especially the enzymes in our foods so i would suggest that we should know that beyond a certain temperature food is destroyed so at every given time uh, what we need to do is to uh, combine a lot of raw fruits and vegetables at our tables of course if we are eating a bit of, you know, sort of cooked food, fair enough. But our main diet should essentially be made up of fruits and vegetables in the raw state with the enzymes available to sustain life, to prevent, you know, disease. Once we achieve that, I believe that, you know, there will be enough harmony. You know, health is supposed to be a state of harmony and balance. And disease is supposed to be a state of disharmony and imbalance. And it is the elements that we put into ourselves. If they are balanced, we have health. If they create an imbalance, we have ill health. Flo, ye la madula, ne na de hihiape, takpepe la, doctor ofei agemam, ho, bebia bia cho nu fia la gan nu pa mogbo, le bia bia mea. E blon e pe jiji be ndudu si me la me le wola e ya nye ndodo kwa tuwe na doyoyo na kikia ple e pe jiji nono.
Show. The theme of today's video conference is Be Organic Vegan to Save the Planet. What is your word for those who didn't get the opportunity to come here? Well, essentially, uh, global warming is real. The uh, activities that we engage in can destroy the planet. So the important thing is for us to come to terms with the fact that the gases that are being produced by the animals that we are rearing, methane, is a danger that must be combated by the change of our lifestyle, especially what we put into ourselves in the form of food. And it's not just vegetarian, but organic vegetarianism to save the soil. Chawunwa, Dr. Ofuyi Agiman, Ma Epe Didi, Plague Bedododa, Nahishia. I believe our ultimate objective is to ensure that there is harmony and balance in this world. So I hope and pray that we all have an open mind about our purpose for being on this earth. Mecho akweda da manya gbloade na doctor Kwasi Ageman de epe nyakaka de Ghana ple tepe bubuao me de kadodo sile na madumadu pe agbe nono nti pe la me sen van van me nono na agbe topo mea ple mea pe anigma to mea pe klo la ope jidepo abe doktor agyema ndudu jaje si ana kakande afrika kanta ple hihi abli bua me akpe na me nupo la hwasi o na mea nti nono le agbe jaje nono nti E si akple do e nye jojo me nunya, ple gbongbong me nunya, le nya jojo o me gbe. Thank you our treasured viewers for your company today on Healthy Living. Coming up next is science and spirituality after note of you. May peace and harmony be with you. For more details, please visit www.suprememastertv.com forward slash HL. <laughs>